We all know that yoga is for everyone, um, for men and for women, for boys and girls. Um, but a while back I started developing the theory that um, certain practices were better suited for women and especially certain practices for different ages or stages of a woman's life. And I probably discovered that in retrospect, having gone through various stages myself. Um, so I started yoga 40 years ago and that took me from my um, menstruating years into perimenopause and menopause and postmenopause. And I discovered that yoga was very helpful for me um, at all those different stages. Um, and probably like a lot of people tell me these days, um, yoga is something that they wish they'd started earlier. I think yoga is a great thing for women to learn even when they're in puberty, uh, or maybe especially at that stage um, when their biochemistry is changing so radically. So um, a lot of the um, instability that I would have experienced when I was a teenager, the sensitivity that I had, um, the physical changes would have been put into a better perspective if I'd had yoga then. And I think that's what's possible for us to teach teenagers. I've done that with high school students who've um, kind of got themselves back on a more even keel because they could do certain practices. And then um, 20 and 30 year olds, maybe into their 40s, um, in that stage when they're um, developing their careers, setting up households, having families, um, those menstruating years. I think um, when a woman can do practices that help her with her menstrual period, it makes her um, um, go through those periodic times a lot more um, healthily and happily. Uh, PMS is something that can be helped with yoga and um, certainly the um, time of menstruating not only can be um, a time when some of the symptoms, um, the negative symptoms of menstruation are soothed, but a woman can feel even better after she's done a menstrual practice. And when, um, personally, I came into my perimenopause, I think I did a lot better with it because I had all those years of yoga, so the symptoms weren't so difficult for me. Um, and uh, in thinking about all these transitions that a woman has, um, I know that there are specific uh, poses and sequences that can be done. And I'm really interested in sharing those with women um, in the form of a workshop.